Okay, so this is another video on the Parkour Reborn 1.1 update. And um, that thing that we are going to be doing today is actually climbing the new Vertigo. Because um, Vertigo's interior has been completely reworked. And I think it is absolutely bonkers. So I'm going to walk you guys through how to do it. By the way, I will be using Yank Grappler if you haven't already gotten it. I recommend watching my tutorial. Go go watch my tutorial if you haven't actually gotten a Yank Grappler yet. Because it, it is a very good upgrade. I recommend it to everyone. Okay, so let's get started. I am at spawn. So just keep that as a clarification. So let's go. Let's start guessing there. Now, the thing about the new Vertigo is that it has so many twists and turns. So I'm going to walk you through it today. And you can get to this part any way you like. Honestly, don't worry about doing it the insanely difficult way that i'm doing it but basically if you know how to get to this time trial here vestibule um you don't have to do the insane gaps that i was just doing um you could actually make your way down and then use this ladder so that's the part of the crystal time trial you just come down and then you go to here so this is where i am now okay so what we're gonna do is we're gonna come over here and basically where we're gonna go is actually down there so we need to find a good entry point and you know i think i was literally just there so it's pretty hard to actually jump down to but i'm gonna try and find a good way think this is it so if i you you're you're gonna need like some type of grappler so ooh, whoops whoops okay i can see the insides so you're gonna want to get onto one of these sky arc like the lower sky arc signs and if you just hug this wall and just try and get high as possible on it and then jump down to here it's pretty hard to explain but you just want to go from one of those sky arc posters you can see the lights of them just come down to here okay so here's the entry this entrance now this building you might actually need to uh you might need to do this a few times so let's actually do this i'm gonna go through this little gap i'm gonna springboard onto there okay now, this is where some people get stumped, but uh, just keep on climbing up this until we see this, okay? Gonna leap towards there. I'm gonna keep on going through these doors. And for now, we're gonna keep on going up. So just try and find your fastest way to get up. Um, you don't have to do it exactly how I do it, but do your preferred way. And run across. Okay. Now this is actually a key point, because in this exact room, there is a um, rug synthetic somewhere. I can't fully remember, but it is definitely in this room. Um, so just completely scavenge this particular room in order to find it. So yeah, I'm going to go through that maze, come down. Go into this one, find this red door. Okay, now I'm gonna go up this ladder on a long jump. I'm gonna get onto this ladder. Oh, I'm gonna need to use this, aren't I? So, if you can see an available, um, zip line definitely use it to your advantage okay so if we keep on following our path here now this part is where it gets a little bit tricky now me i died here because i thought it would be a fun idea to jump down 
And um, I actually didn't survive to fall even though I landed on the pad. So I'm just going to go down really ooh, slowly. Go at your own pace. Um, okay. Yeah. Thankfully, I can respawn here. So going to go at our own pace. And now we're just gonna land on here. All right, now the easiest way to do this is just come up. Oh, whoops. We're gonna need to go into that room up there, but trust me, I'll show you how. Go up into here, into this room. And, oh, whoops. Stay up on this one. Well, you could just go into this one, my bad. Um, jump across. And jump up, like that. Okay. Now this door should be the correct door. And you come up here. And then you find this vent. And then you go up this ladder into this one. And you just try to follow my path, you definitely find it. Now here, come down, open this door, and just basically keep on hopping on top of these. Just keep on hopping. Now by the way, I do have glove. I will be um, introducing a tutorial on how to get the glove. Um, on a later time so just keep on following these piles of crates here until you get over here and here you go we are finally going to on to the next part now we're gonna go up and go through this red door springboard onto this pipe well ladder um it's not that way it's this way no, never mind, it's not that way, it is this way. My mind was correct. You have to go up. Okay, now just... Oh, careful. Yeah, if you don't make that, you're not completely screwed. But you're gonna hold... <coughs> <coughs> but you're gonna have to hope that you know how to grapple high jump. So you're gonna grapple high jump. Mine is a little bit bigger because it's a yank grappler, but I'm sure you can do it with the regular. Um, if you haven't gotten it, um, if you haven't gotten the right, uh, uh, the anchor grappler, I definitely emphasize on you getting it. It's not very hard. Um, so now I'm just gonna land on here. That was a bit risky. That's fine. We was able to land. Um, now how I'm gonna get up, I'm gonna kind of vault onto this pipe. Go onto this zip line, onto this pipe, and over to this red door. So we gotta go up here. Then I recommend if you want this to go quicker, slide down a little bit, but when you get here, stop, okay? So, what should we do? What should we do, guys? I think I'm going to I'm going to emphasize on going there. But if that seems a bit tricky, don't worry, it's completely fine. Um at least try to save yourself from landing by doing some wall runs over there and then a wall kick at the end. So yeah. I'm gonna keep on going. Oh, I've messed up a little bit. Oh, what I needed to do was I needed to get on here, right? So, go on to here. I'm gonna springboard just to be going a bit higher. Right, 
This is like a little bit of a safety net. But if you don't know. Oh no! Okay, my bad. If you guys wanna re uh, wind to where I get back, it's completely fine. Um, I'm just gonna kinda show you guys a little bit of me trying to go fast now. All right, so you wanna you wanna be really careful. You need to get over here somehow, somehow. Now we're gonna get up here, go onto this zip line, climb onto this pipe. Right now, we're gonna leap from this pipe onto here, and then we're gonna go through this red door. This is probably one of the hardest rooms in the game. Now we're just gonna keep on going up through this door. And now, I'm gonna go through this one. And here is a little bit of a nice, cozy place. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna go through this elevator here. Now, we're gonna go through this door. Now, this part is a little bit tricky. So, I'm gonna try and do this using as little of my grappler as usual. So, I'm gonna. Okay, yeah, that's pretty hard without the grappler. I can already see that. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go as high as I can, grapple high jump, and just climb up. Then I'm going to... Climb like that. I'm going to try and use only one grapple. My bad. Now we're going to springboard and climbing like that and now you are basically at the top you just go onto this ladder but you can go and activate this nice computer here and um you can actually get the transceiver for vertigo hope you guys enjoyed all uh if you did and you found it interesting and helpful please consider liking the video and subscribing and yeah i'll see you guys in the next one thanks for watching of course see ya